September. Most people won't be inside the X with the delegates. And Fox 9's Jamie Reese is live in the newsroom with a new project offering a way to make your voice heard anyway. Jamie? Jeff, politicians talk to us through those commercials that always end with, I approve this message. Well, this is billed as an opportunity for us to talk back. It's a hot topic. Filmmaker Mark Wojohn's latest project started with a single question. Hey, the Republicans are coming this fall. What message do you have for them? Three rights for all banjo players. Some people were welcoming and some people were angry. But they're going to get a surprise when they come here. So it really sort of ran the course of like um, anything from like people being like, hey, I really hope they have a great convention to like people like wanting to like flip the camera off. The Walker Art Center asked him to turn his camera on the Twin Cities to make one of the first videos for a new project called I Approve This Message. And I approve this message. Videos made by anyone uploaded to YouTube collected on the project website. People really want to talk about politics, especially during this election. And I brought my own little camera. The Walker and citizen journalism group The Uptake sponsor the forum. Most of us won't be able to be inside the Excel Center this September. Why not give everybody else a chance to talk about the issues that are important to them. They say political messages are made more powerful by the media. I approve of this. Seeing someone in the, maybe, you know, how angry or silly or whatever it is, you can see the emotion in what someone is trying to communicate. The goal is to start a dialogue. Filmmaker Wojan hopes it starts much more. I think it all begins with dialogue and hope, hopefully what follows words is a positive action. Let's go vote with our cameras. Selective videos will be screened at the Walker later this summer. The museum is also holding workshops on how to shoot and edit video. You can find the details and all the latest election news on our website. Go to myfox9.com and click on the Politics tab. Live in the newsroom, Jamie Reese, Fox 9 News.